Half of the tornadoes we saw in 2020 happened in the month of January, and they did the most damage in the Troy area. Storm Team 2 meteorologist Carly Smith has our 2 News follow-up. Four tornadoes were recorded in the Miami Valley. Three were in Miami County. One taking a direct hit right here in downtown Troy, where some businesses are still rebuilding. A lot of our damage was to the uh, historic buildings in and around the courthouse. Joel Smith is the Miami County Emergency Management Director. This time last year, I never would have thought we would spend nine months of the year dealing with the coronavirus, or would I have predicted that we would have had three EF zero tornadoes. The tornadoes in Troy and Fletcher happened on January 11th. Not something that anybody would have expected. We saw some pretty sizable damage, even though it was an EF zero. And we were all freaking out about our shop and, you know, hoping it's okay like everybody else. But luckily, we didn't have too much damage to our roof, actually. We had a little bit of damage, but it wasn't too bad like the other buildings around here. And they're still working on the on repairing some of those buildings today. The peak wind gust through Troy was 80 miles per hour. We saw like all these parts of the building like down crash on the, the ground and all these cars that are damaged and everything. It was it was kind of scary. And during the National Weather Service survey, Smith saw all the damage, but he also saw the community coming together. For every um, household that had some damage, I saw three and four other households from the neighborhood helping them clean up. I'm so blessed to be a part of Troy. Like, I think it's such a cool place to live and grow up. In Troy, for Storm Team 2, I'm meteorologist Carly Smith. And